na mimi ninataka ushuru ipandishwe 100% katika hii mambo ya makeup katika It's a, it's a good feeling to be here uh, to witness uh, opening of uh, the National Assembly under the leadership of His Excellency President William Samoy Ruto. Some of us, you know, uh, we come from the Kenya Council Coalition. We had a very tough campaign. We had uh, a promise to the people of Kenya. We discussed a lot about uh, the Hustler Fund. The President addressed the Hustlers Fund. And we are looking forward to a good economy in the coming days. And I believe that with his leadership, everything is going to be in control. And the economy is going to uh, take full uphill uh, to a stand. Oshima, maybe you can highlight from uh, His Excellency's speech, maybe what is the key points, maybe I say, Well, it's a super speech. The president spoke very well. He spoke uh, very briefly, though. Uh, it has never happened in the history. Many presidents before, as you are aware, they always have long speeches. He just highlighted on the issues that face the common Mwanainchi. And he's looking forward to uh, uh, work with the legislature. And we are looking forward to support uh, the government. Uh, Mwishima, you mentioned, uh, you spoke about the Hustler Fund. Ebu muongeleshe ule Hustler ya kopale nje. Jana tumeona raisa ameweza kutangaza kushirikiana na mashirika ya mabenki, safaricom. Wameza kupunguza ada labla ili mikopo ya simu. Muongeleshe ule mwanainchi wako pale kwenye constituency ambaye ataweza kufaidika na mambo kama hae. Nataka, nataka kueleza kwamba, unajua kwamba mambo ya Hustlers Fund ni pesa ambaye itasaidia wananchi wote ni pesa ambaye kila mtu anatarajia sio pesa ya Kenya kwanza wabunge peke yake ni ya nchi nzima wale ambao walimchagua William Ruto na wale ambao hawakumchagua watakuwa miongoni mwa wale ambao watafaidika kwa sababu hizo pesa zitapelekwa mashinani na mnajua vile kazi ya CDF inafanya and i am sure hii pesa ya Hustlers Fund itafanya vizuri zaidi na itaweza kusaidia kuondoa umaskini katika taifa hili letu la Kenya. Uh, Mheshimiwa pia tumeona jana uh, hivi juzi rais ameweza kutoa baraza lake za mawaziri. Sasa wa, jukumu ni lenu kama wabunge muweze kuidhinisha yale majina. Siju uleonaje ile orodha wewe kama mbunge na wale watu ambao unawafahamu una, 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 una kivipi? Orodha ambayo ilipeanwa na rais uh, wale ambao aliwapendekeza wachaguliwe kama kama uh, viongozi katika cabinet mimi niko na imani na wao wengi wao ninawajua wamekuwa kifanya kazi katika uh, sekta mbalimbali mbali ya uongozi so i have a lot of confidence in that leadership and i can assure you kwamba wale ambao wamekuwa wame, wame nominated tunaongojea tukirudi katika bunge tutawapitisha bila wasiwasi yoyote Uh, sasa ujumbe wa mwisho tu labda uh, ukianza sasa bunge limeanza vikao vyake rasmi ujumbe wa mwisho kwa wananchi wananchi nataka kuambia kwamba wawe tu na matarajio mambo ni mengi na nina imani kwamba yale ambaye manifesto ya Kenya kwanza ilisema mambo ya big four agenda mambo ya NHIF ku roll out ili kila mkenya apate bima ya, 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 ya matibabu na mambo mengi na hii mambo ya housing project ya low cost housing nina imani kwamba Mambo yatakuwa chonjo shwari kabisa mia kwa mia katika uongozi wa William Samoe Ruto. Asante sana mheshimiwa kwa wakati wako. Asante sana. Hakuna swali kwa upinzani. <laughs> Ninawauliza watu wa upinzani, watu ya azimio, muko wapi na makelele mingi, mnakuwa mnapiga mnatuzumbua. Wako wapi? Hatujaona kwa bunge, wamekuja kidogo, muko wapi? Mbona msikuje hapa kupiga piga makelele, unasema kwamba muko na numbers katika katika bunge la taifa, hakuna kitu yote. Sasa wacha tupange kazi, wao wakae katika backbench, waangalie vile inchi inaendeshwa na sisi tutaendesha msaada hapa katika bunge bila wasiwasi yote. Santeni sana. Mheshimiwa tuliona pale awali uliweza kutoa post ukasema kuna bili hapo special ambao utaweza kuipitisha ungependekeza ile ya makeup yes makeup kit vitu za Canada ongeze tax kidogo inafaa inafaa uh, it's time to go natural wa mama wametusumbua nina imani kwamba serikali inatafuta njia ya kupata uh, fedha we must expand our tax uh, uh, target na niko na imani kwa sababu hao madada ndio wanatumia hizo vitu na mimi ninataka ushuru ipandishwe 100% katika hii mambo ya makeup katika hii mambo ya hii vitu za vipodozi sijui wig hii watu wametusumbua sana 
eh, my license sijui manini mimi nitaleta hiyo mswada na nitahakikisha hiyo bill ita tutaisukuma na hiyo bei ziongezeke kabisa ili tuweze kuchukua ushuru kutoka kwa wakina hawa kina mama na hata hivyo wanalalamika wanalalamika kwa nini kwa sababu kwanza hawa watoi hiyo pesa hizo pesa zinatolewa na sisi wenyewe eh hey, bwana waongoje hiyo maneno nitaileta hapa na tutahakikisha the, 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 the issue of the taxation about hizo mambo ya makeup by friend wa mama wako na shida katika taifa hili la Kenya. But kuna wale ukina dada ambao wamemaliza shule, wamesomea mambo ya biti, mm. wamejiajiri wenyewe, mm. wanajisukuma wenyewe. Ukiongeza tax ili utaweza kuendelea na kazi yao, utaendelea kufanya kazi zao? Kazi zitaendelea kwa sababu watu wako hapa nje wengi wanawasaidia katika eh, mambo mengi sana kwa mfano unasikia mambo ya hustlers fund. Kuna pesa itatoka hapo, waje wachukue hizo pesa, wajisaidie katika mambo yao. Lakini masuala hiyo ya makeup watajua hawajui. Hiyo bill lazima ipitishwe bungeni. <laughs> Asante